Let's go play convoy, people. We're live. Climbing there. We're up to a thousand already. Let's go! Sure, sure, sure. Share the hell out of this, guys. We are at the Ottawa International Airport and we are slow rolling the airport. Freedom, 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 freedom. Nice, beautiful day today. It is. Good morning, guys. So we are slow rolling the Ottawa International Airport right now. We're playing some freedoming stuff. <laughs> no, I didn't get my bank figured out. They're, the government of Canada has eliminated any option for me to use Interact. Because you'll no, e find out the Interact is e-transfer. No. Uh, Interact is owned by your government. So be careful when you're doing freedom stuff. The government doesn't like it. So they'll set down your Interact. <laughs> to those out in the West, uh, good luck. We should find out. We heard that there is that con uh, people jammed up out there. There are 40 trucks or something sitting outside. We gotta find out about what was that shout out on here. All right, guys, here we go. That sec every second vehicle from behind us, you're gonna book into the arrivals. You're gonna see this little spot right up here. You're gonna do a loop on the way out, and you're gonna just keep looping this big circle right here. Freedom. To any of the truckers that are jammed out there somewhere, you go to 302 Coventry Street. That's where you guys can go. Anybody who's on the outskirts of the city, who need to get into the city where there's food, showers, and everything, go to 302 Coventry. What's the name of that hotel that's right there? That's the uh, Marriott Hilton or something? Marriott Hilton, yeah. The RCGT Arena. Uh, 302 Coventry. Any truckers or people outside the city, that's where you can go. Sorry guys, I didn't bring my holder today. I work at Pearson. I'm loving this. Let's go, boys. <laughs> we gonna go to Ottawa. Yeah? Did they shut everyone down? No, nope, we're rolling. Uh, no, there's lots of people. Alright, guys. Start jamming her up. This is the loop right here. You're gonna come around, you're gonna keep looping this. That guy got through our convoy, jam it up. <coughs> All right, we're doing departures. You second vehicle doing arrivals. one we're gonna do both of them you're gonna do arrivals right here we're Take gonna jam them all both arrivals and departures what do you want me to do follow your side to side or no you're gonna go this way you're gonna lead a group that way yeah. we're going this way there you go guys you're gonna split right here Freedom! let those horns go We got the construction boys up there. Hey fellas. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> freedom! Freedom, freedom, freedom! <laughs> This guy's double masked, driving around in his van right there. That boy is scared. He's, hopefully he wakes up soon. 
Hopefully he wakes up soon. Pray for those guys. Wow, the Ottawa airport looks pretty small, man. How many people flying right now? We got ourselves a convoy. That's all right. We'll get it. We're going to loop this for a couple hours. Look at this guy just scrambling. He's trying to get, get in. Get in. Get in. Let's go, buddy. Too bad. Let's walk him in. <laughs> he can stay. Freedom! Freedom, freedom, freedom! Oh, we love you! We love you! God bless! I got I just got I just got my second I love you. <laughs> <laughs> That's my second I love you. Well that guy got Alright guys, you're just gonna do keep looping this. We're gonna loop this all fucking day long. We're just gonna keep going around circle. Uh -huh. All right, now here's your loop. Yeah. We're just going to keep looping around. Cause some noise, get some middle fingers so we can say I love you. <laughs> All right, there's your loop. And here's your loop, guys. So now you're just gonna keep looping right into here. Jam up both lanes. Jam up all lanes, guys. Oh, we're jamming them up. Good. And just keep looping, just keep looping. There's Byron, <laughs> there's Byron. <laughs> There you go. You just keep going circles. Just circling it. That's it, man. We're doing it. You're gonna now you're gonna go up departures. Okay. We'll go arrivals. We're gonna jam up both lanes though. I see lots of people getting through here. Freedom! <laughs> What? Oh, don't worry. You're gonna catch us. We're all looping now. Keep this catch up. Let's go. Let's go. As you can see, we're having fun. We're this way this time. Yeah, we're gonna do this one. Yeah, there's our convoy, guys. All right, we just found the tail end of the arrivals. <laughs> now, groups going up departures and arrivals. Just keep going around. Just keep looping the shit out of this, guys. Let's go! Oh, right, we got the cops are perfect. Hey, my horn seems to be working a bit better today. It's fixing itself. God bless. <laughs> Go Bears! Way to go, Canada! Let's go!
Conroy for you. That's it, guys. Start jamming her up. There you go. It's working. They're going, oh shit. <laughs> These crazy Alberta boys brought this convoy over here. <laughs> Freedom! That guy literally had spray paint down the side of his awesome Ford truck. Like, literally spray painted his truck. That's awesome. There's Misty. Misty, what up, girlfriend? What's up? Read up, read up, read up, read up. <laughs> what a good day. <laughs> Just smiling. Should have never, ever denied me my flight. The day that I had to hitchhike across Canada and our Canadian people got with me, helped me across Canada, Dave... <laughs> Dave and Wawa gave me a vehicle. Well, guess what, Trudeau? Your mandate of me being able to fly, you should have thought twice about it. And now we're just going to keep looping. Hear you. We're gonna keep rolling this airport for however long it takes. Oh well, yeah, a couple hours for sure. Three hours? Yeah, hours? we're good. <laughs> Convoy back into the city again. Hey Max, where are you, Max? We're gonna go around the rivals again. Mad Max? I don't know, it's his birthday today. Oh, what? We got yeah. another birthday? We got a birthday in the convoy, yeah? Oh, boy. We better stop and sing them. We'll just stop right here. <laughs> 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 What's that? Plane arriving 913 for Ottawa. Yeah, I know. I know. We're here to... Trust me. There's a reason we're here. <laughs> Owen's doing his uh, video down here. We'll go this way again. Freedoming. That's where the cops are, too. See what they're up to. How long before they come and block or all? Oh, we're not doing anything wrong. We're driving. Yeah. We're not even breaking the law, are we? No. Oh, oh mischief. It'll be mischief. That's what they'll try to do. A silly mischief thing. Oh, we almost got a full loop right now. So you can see them up there. We almost got a full loop here, guys. We're we'll pretend to stop. Oh, yep. That's a three second stop from where I'm from. Freedom! Let's go! Yeah, my horn is working much better today. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll fix that. Freedom! Freedom! Where are we going? She's jammed up up top, too. Yeah, we got her jammed up up top. There we go. I think everybody pretty much is here. Or? And that's your... Uh, that's how you slow roll an airport. <laughs> you know what? I don't care what anybody says. These mandates are illegal. If you want to stay home and you want to wear a mask and you don't want to go out and you want to get your jab, that is fine with me. You are more than welcome to do that. But what I want to do is I want to be able to travel. I want to be able to uh, go into a restaurant. I want to be able to go enjoy my life and if i die i die you know why because that's my choice my choice my freedom of choice and i don't give a hell crap i don't give any care in the world 
if it's my time to go and the creator is asking me to go, then I will go. That's just plain and simple. That's the joys of being free. So now we're going to just slow roll the airport. Ah, uh, yes, we need volunteers this weekend. We need volunteers all the time. To any of those trucks out there, don't forget, 302 Coventry. Anybody trapped outside there, get the 302 Coventry. There's a good truck stop there. There's space. They'll get you in there. Okay, they got food. Everything's set up there. Get out. You can come into the inside of the city, guys. Get off the outskirts <laughs> and get in here. Oh, yeah, we got a jam, Dave. We got a jam pretty good. <laughs> yeah, we're at a slow crawl, guys. <laughs> yeah. Man, this is fun. <laughs> I'm born for this. Way to go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> All right, oh, so much yeah. Fun. This is how you wake up the city in the morning. <laughs> noony, 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 noo. We need some big air horns. We need that car with the horn sticking out of the top of the... Uh... We've seen that one car, and he was a kind of an older car, and he had big air horns. He cut a hole in the roof. Oh yeah, he had, him yeah. Up. Oh, he had these big oh. freaking. Imagine what it was like to sit inside there. Oh my god! People are having fun, guys. Get out here to Ottawa if you can. Get out here to Ottawa. If you can. It's a parade. <laughs> it's a parade. <laughs> Good morning from Ottawa International Airport, ladies and gentlemen. We are the Freedom Convoy. Freedom Air is about to depart. No mass, no vax, no problem. <laughs> Freedom Airlines, baby. Freedom Airlines. I want to start a new airline called that. I want to call it Freedom Airlines. No vax, no mask, no problem. Yep. And all they'll say is just freedom down the side <laughs> of the planes. <laughs> hey guys, let's start two two lanes, eh? Let's start rolling two lanes, you guys. Copy that, two lanes. And then when you get to the arrivals and departures, we split every second vehicle. One goes arrivals, one goes departure. <laughs> so we'll do one one lap of uh, departure now, and then we'll go pick up. Oh, look at that, cute! It's a Prius. Look at a Prius. Yeah, two lanes, two lanes. That's so you're coming in big rigs down here. Yeah, I was hoping the boys were up, but you know what? Some of them can have some sleep. This is fun too, and we can scatter a lot easier. Oh, this is true. But once they see us do this, now we're gonna. The next time we're gonna get ourselves some big rigs down here and really make some noise. Any of you Alberta boys? There you go, boys. That's it. Double leaner. Yeah, the ports, Scotty. Uh, actually, the ports are being done already. Yes. Uh, we've got the ships. The guys from the Marine for Freedom, um, 2022. They're doing theirs around the ports of Halifax. Um, so if you're out on the west co or east coast, go ahead and roll that side. We almost got a full circle, guys. <laughs> we almost got a full circle. Of, of both of, ways. Of yeah. both ways, yeah. Oh, somebody, somebody somewhere might have a flight out today. I don't know, though, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> there's lots of rumors out there. Yeah, there's so. lots of rumors. There's some people that are flying out. Um, but it's looking pretty empty here today. Yeah, it's pretty quiet, guys. But except for us. Yeah, but there is a, there is a certain time that there's a certain flight that's leaving. Yeah, boys. Freedom! Freedom! Yes. Haha, <laughs> I'm really
really happy my horn's working better today. Freedom, freedom, freedom! Hey guys, we got lots of support. Guys, show those airline stewardesses some support. They're waving at us saying thank you. You got the staff from Air Canada is all standing outside the one door. Wow. Maybe we should. So you think they're going to drop the flight mandate soon? I hope so. People can fly across the country with no mask. Can you imagine getting on an airplane right now after all of this and going, hey, you know what? I was a part of that. I was a part of that day that we all stood and we ah, all... look at those boys. <laughs> these guys. <laughs> Read on. Look at these boys. <laughs> oh, that's what we're talking about right there. Okay, I'm going to jump out too where this lady is. I'm going to stand where this lady is, George. Where? Right here. Oh, okay. They'll let you go around pick me up on the fly. Right, I'll come back around. I'll yeah. grab a one from the bottom one. Yeah. All right. Hang on.
Nobody rides for free. Get in the freedom truck, Paul. <laughs> freedom! Doing awesome, everybody. Oh, even the cops. Look at even the cops. We're listening. This thing is going crazy, man. It's got like a machine gun on it. Even the cops were waving at us. They loved it, guys. You guys are doing great. Just keep going. <laughs> we're gonna go hours at this. Oh yeah. <laughs> Did you see the cops? No. They were giving us high fives and everything. And even that guy. I got one of us over here somewhere, or back here on the parking. All right, just uh, abide by the rules and, uh, you know, you're not doing anything wrong. You're just slow rolling. Everybody's traffic's getting in and out. They're going to come and start doing that soon. What about our horns that we're going to get pulled over for that, or is it just in uh, Let them buck. You want some transparency from these guys, do you, Richard? Um, just got to understand this, buddy. There aren't higher-ups. There are people that are working different angles in different places. Maybe the choice of words that I used was a little different, but you got to understand, the only way to do this is by having direction. So there is a whole team of people in a control room that were taking direction. Now, I'm on the side of boots Freedom. on the ground Freedom. and that's the direction that I'm giving now there's guys on the boots on that are in the in the rooms that are talking to the politicians there's guys in the rooms that are talking to the municipal leaders there's guys in the rooms that are dealing with just law enforcement and girls there yeah there's yeah, guys and gals are, are dealing with all different aspects to this it may look like we're just a convoy parked on the road but there is a lot of work that needs to be done and it takes a little bit of time. Not everything, not everything happens in like that. Yeah. Stay tuned. But stay tuned. <laughs> it's going to get better very soon. Let's go. Freedom, 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 freedom. So did they, uh, he said at arrivals, they had that guy? Oh, uh, I think so, arrivals or departures. Well, we went to arrivals last time, so we're going to departures. We got to switch it up. Look at all these beautiful humans out here just freedoming the shit out of it. Look at here, we got some ladies here. Look at these little kids out here, guys. I hate some signs up. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Thanks, guys. Yeah. That's oh. Yeah, guys. 
people cheering over the fences over there. We're starting to gather a crowd. We're, We're starting to gain steam Let's here, guys. Go. We need some support down here on the bridges. We're gonna need some coffee down here, some donuts. <laughs> Maybe a porta potty so people can pull over and have a pee. <laughs> Nobody's blocking any elderly people from getting health care. Oh, wow. Grow up. Yeah. There's there's lanes open everywhere for, for that stuff. Nice try. Trolls. We, pray for that troll. Pray for that troll. Section 6 of the Charter. You're infringing on Canadian rights. Who is? No, the government is. Yeah. <laughs> what, what rights are we taking away? You know? Yeah. Some people just got to live in their own little bubble of uh, anger and aggression, so. Yeah, we're exercising our rights for freedom. Freedom of expression. Huh? Freedom of choice, baby. <laughs> yeah, let's go! Did you see the cops in the van back there? Yeah. Yeah. There'll be more and more cops coming here soon. Yeah, guys. That's the good Lord. They're gonna need a horn today, he says, so he fixes it. <laughs> we gotta jab up those airport people a little bit so you, you know the thing is these guys they're gonna get frustrated and they're gonna make a bunch of phone calls and emails and stuff like that and that's a good thing you know they're gonna be wondering what the heck is going on get a hold of your mayor <laughs> I just want to let everybody know, we are not impeding on anybody. We have all lanes open for emergencies. We have people able to get in and out for any emergency. We let the paramedics pass just on their way out here. We are giving her, guys. We're giving her the way it's supposed to be. Polite, respectful, and you know what? Getting some notice. We're getting some notice, guys. And that's all we're going to do here. We're just going to get notice. The airplane staff, all the guys from Air Canada came out. They were all cheering us on. The construction guys at the airport are all out. They're cheering us on. There's people that are in their hangars on the other side of the fences. They're all outside of their fences. They're cheering us on. Don't tell me for one minute that people aren't seeing what we're doing. And they're respecting exactly what we're doing. Freedom! 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 freedom. You see that? See that? That's a lane. That's a lane that's open. See that other lane? That lane's open. Watch this. And we're going to roll the airport for a couple hours. <laughs> Ang Fong? Who's Ang Fong? Ang Fong? That's right, I was refused a flight on WestJet. The evening they put the mandates down in, in Ontario, they moved them at 3.05 in the morning. That same day I was flying out, I was supposed to have a 72 hour window that because I booked my flight before the mandates kicked in, that I was supposed to be able to get on an airplane. 
When I got to the airport that night, at 6 o'clock at night, I was told I was not allowed to get on the airplane. And I ended up having to hitchhike, basically, get people to piggyback me across Ontario. Then I got as far as Wawa, Ontario, and a friend, Dave, he gave me a car. His car, he let me use to drive back the rest of the way across Canada. And I ended up getting home. But I had to drive three and a half thousand kilometers to get home when I should have been home in four hours. Watching from Tulsa, Oklahoma, who knew freedom could be this much fun? <laughs> freedom! <laughs> Guys, if there's somebody in here who's being angry and aggressive and they're being ornery, don't worry about it. Pray for them. Pray for them. Okay. Let them know that they can stay at home if they want. They can wear their mask if they want. They can take their jab if they want. You can do whatever you want because that's freedom, baby. That is freedom, baby. I should do a reality show after this, somebody said. <laughs> I'm gonna go to sleep after this for a month. Probably didn't bring anything. Watching from smoker. Buffalo, Illinois. No, I'm uh, sure Nick, somebody I'm a, does. I'm a smoker, not bring the smoke. My paint. Freedom! Well, it looks like we've got uh, almost a double circle here going. Be a good space for a few you more. You see them still up? They're up on the top there. If you see the flags flying up top. Way to go, Canada! Way to go, Patriots! Stand up, get those vibes up there. Yeah, we did see a picture of Doug Ford's daughter. We saw that. What did he do? Doug Ford's daughter was out flying a flag at the Toronto protest. Oh, this yeah. is all wrong, you guys. The whole works. The whole kit and caboodle, man. I don't care who you are. You'll wake up eventually when it's your turn. Let go of the hate. Hello from a fellow Canadian in Italy. I wish I could leave here to support you guys. Oh, Carmel, Nicole, Car Carmel, Nicole. You know what? Don't worry, honey, we're doing it here. We're doing it for you guys. We're here in spirit. Tear the lines out. Go the world. Look at the smile on that guy's face. Right on. <laughs> you want some work, man? Uh, yeah, keep going, guys. Don't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. We got a job to do. We ain't leaving until it's done. And you know what? You should have never banned me from flying. You should have never Freedom! denied me my flight. Because I told you guys, the next time I have to come back here, coming awesome. back with a nation. He can turn his and I think too. we got it. <laughs> yeah, up, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Freedom! It just keeps going and going and going and going. Let's go! 
I don't know how George hasn't lost his voice yet. That's unreal. Your children want to meet me so bad. You're their new idol. <laughs> nah, come on, guys. Just a guy. Just a guy. Having fun fighting for freedoms. With no bullets. Yeah, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know if you heard about Nova Scotia, but if you even put a flag on your vehicle and fly around, they're threatening you with $10,000 fine. $10,000 fine. Okay, so Nova Scotia. That would give me more incentive to get my ass up off the couch and I would fly 50 okay, flags on my vehicle and I would be driving around. Why in the hell would you sit back and allow them to tell you you can't do something? Your government works for you, not the other way around. Who's putting the mask on you? It ain't the government, it's you. Oh, you who's making you get the jabs? It ain't the government, it's you. You're the one who's making yourself do this stuff. So, if you want to be the change you want to see in this world, then be that change. Yes, sir. Freedom! Good, good. That guy's awesome, he's got a plow on there. Yeah, he's got the plow and he rocks it back and forth. <laughs> so when, uh, when we get snowed in, we're good, guys. We'll just push our own snow, make our own trails. Watching from PEI, let her rip guys and gals. PEI, there's another one, hold up. You guys are getting hooked. I can't believe what they did to PEI. Yeah, but many are still out. So yeah, on a 100%, make sure that you're uh, out there, boots on the ground. Show this government that their little fear tactics aren't gonna work, that you don't care what they do. You know what, the government works for us, okay? They work for us. Not the other way around. And they're not doing their job. And they're not. They're, they're dictating, Where's, not governing. Where's your money going? Where's our tax dollars going? Right? You know? Fuck this. We're done. We want every single premier in this country to resign. Yeah. Every single one of you. Put someone else in charge, you're done. Get after those premiers. Freedom! Another guy with a plow. See, we're doing good out here. Man, I see a lot of freedom around here. Lots of freedom. <laughs> I love the smell of freedom in the morning. And we're back to the tail. <laughs> and these are cops right on the right side here. In this van? Yeah. Oh, they're the ones that are following us around all over in that van maybe. Yeah, so those are police there on the van. Sitting there getting everybody's license plates. And yeah. Seeing who they can pull over Go who doesn't ahead, have pull, insurance and registration. Pull whoever you want over. Yeah. We're not stopping, guys. He's got a big plow, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's a city guy. Play some music for you guys while we're freedoming. Might get us shut down, though. Why? Because of copyright. Oh? Yeah, and it does it all the time. Oh, we don't want to A do friend that. got 2700 Hang on. friend got 2700 in Canadian Tire here in Nova Scotia yesterday. For what? I don't know. Hang on. For no mask. Manager grabbed him when my friend, the cops, the cops charged him. Right on. The cops charged the guy who grabbed him. For assault, yeah. You can't be touching people. Ugh. <coughs> All you power hungry uh, youngins that are in the uh, in the stores and stuff, you know, get out of here. I knew a guy from PEI, his last name was Potato, fell in love with Heinz Ketchup. Ketchup loves potatoes. <laughs> Bud the Spud in the big bed run, driving down the highway smiling. Well, the Spuds are big in the back of Bud's rig. He's from Prince Edward Island. He's from Prince Edward Island. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, Canada. We need you in Ottawa. Once again, 302 Coventry for any of the trucks, anybody that needs to get down there. Also, um, what's the S-Jam called again? The street? Sir John A. McDonald Parkway. Sir John A. McDonald Parkway. 
you guys make your way down there too they got a kitchen and a big tent set up there there's two places that you can stage at then we can join these convoys okay let's go move into the city Freedom Convoy 2022. Yeah, forcing people with fear of losing their job is coercion. You guys are you guys are more entertaining than my regular morning radio show. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> this is your radio show now. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, my email money transfers are shut down, guys. I cannot get any donations. I can't send out money to the truckers unless I go and pull it out with cash. So it's been a cash roll. So I can pull the money out and I can go and give them the cash. And that's what we've been doing. You need to make a Freedom Convoy playlist. Newfoundland is doing a convoy. Got to keep trucking. Where to right go, on. Newfoundland? Let's go, Newfoundland. PEI can't leave by plane or boat. We got him locked down. Right yeah, there. they got him locked right down. If he shows up and doesn't storm out. Yeah, we got to be careful of the music in the back. And if you've never heard him sing live, you're going to be blown away. And he's just a cool dude. Who at one point, just a few short years ago, uh, songwriter and singer hey buddy. was not on his radar. Freedom! Good job, job to you. I decided to go a different path and bad relationship breakup and suddenly I'm, like, no, I'm gonna go write this down. He wrote the song down, giving you up. And then you have to follow it to its completion. And that's what led him to I know, so good thing, silver lining. Come from back in here, bro. Cameron Marlowe, joining us with an update. I'll find this one. Is that? Yeah, I'll have to. I'll wait till we get that. Yes, sir. Ottawa Airport jammed up. Freedom! Currently on unpaid leave, LOA. How's it going? <laughs> Thank you, guys. Look at this guy taking a picture. Canadian Border Services. All by herself. All by themselves with masks on. There we go. Let's get these guys. You guys online, baby. <laughs> this is how we do it in Canada, baby. Oh, fuck, really? You coming to the airport? Nice. Dad bought on his way to the airport. No, is he? Yeah. Right on. Wait. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get over here, Dad bod. Watch, 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 watch. Yep, exercising their rights. More people coming in. Oh. A few hours apparently. We got 11.1 thousand in here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I can't work as security at Pearson unless I'm job. That sucks. All right, we got the, the police officers are right behind us now. Are they? Yeah, in the minivan. Yeah, they're right behind me. We got five old block in the loop here, guys. Well, I got one in a minivan right behind me now, and I think he's waiting to see what we do. There's also one rolling around in a 350 with a canopy. If it's the white dually, that's the one that pulled me over yesterday. Yeah, they're closing the loop off. 
Oh, they're closing the loop off, guys. They're getting a plan. Well, look at these going on. Anyway, we can go down and turn around and come back in the other way then? Yep, if we have to, we'll go all the way down and we'll find an off ramp and circle the off ramps. See, they were checking out my, uh, they'd have been checking out my registration and insurance behind us, and I'm good to go. So, freedom on! Freedom in! <laughs> I'm a nurse in a nursing home, and I was not able to work without the job. Uh, but yet now, nurses in Ontario are allowed to go back if they've been jabbed, even if they test positive. Something wrong there, guys. Yeah. Something wrong, and nobody wants to question the elephant in the room. What's going on with that? Freedom! Let's go! <laughs> I bet you we scrambled those guys this morning. They're probably still in bed. No, they got to work hard against us. <laughs> well, one of the police officers wanted to have a secret meeting with me again this morning. Where can we meet, Pat? Well, young lady, I'm at the airport. <laughs> they said you were a hard guy to find. Yeah, they said I was a hard guy to find, so they wanted to meet up today. We're doing our job, George. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> of course we're hard to find. <laughs> We only are seen when you want us. Uh, I, was, I was made for this. You got to understand, we're not just trucks here, guys. We got thousands of four-wheelers with us, too. You know what? I'm not doing anything wrong. The government can do whatever they want. I'm not doing anything wrong. We haven't impeded on traffic. We're driving safe. Okay, we're... so the cops must have this blocked off a bit. Yeah, well, you know what? They just jammed up the airport on their own. <laughs> yeah, now you're impeding traffic. Hey, guys, I know that the uh, cops blocked the circle route that we were doing, but look what they've done. They've jammed up traffic on their own. It wasn't us. We haven't stopped. We've been rolling the whole time. Now the cops got us blocked. Well, it's the police officers now that have this stopped, not us. <laughs> Freedom. We're all watching it. Like now we're at a we're at a standstill. All because of the police officers. Well, they were only in. They opened that bypass up for that loop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we are. Freedom! Yeah, because they got us blocked, man. If they block us, then that impedes on traffic. We're not stopping, we're rolling the whole time, right? So while we're rolling, we're not hurting anybody. Now if they want to stop us, that's them blocking traffic, not us. Yeah. Oh, open, keep this guy's even driving up on the curb to get out of here in his van. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> I'm out of here, he says. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, look at him go right up on the curb. Hey, he's getting out of here. <laughs> Now that we got some mandates dropping, now it's time to get rid of all the premiers. When Trudeau goes to jail, he can have all the mandates he wants. <laughs> every, day. every day, a different mandate. So, yeah, every day he got a different mandate every day while he's in prison. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, what is the only person in all of Ottawa that could piss off the Ottawa Police Department? Jerry can. <laughs> <laughs> the only person in Ottawa that can piss off the whole entire Ottawa police force is Jerry Can. It's stuck at one, 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 one. I know, it keeps doing that. It is what it that's is. That's good, though. I know. That's but a it's, good number. I know, it's an angel number. Yeah, one, one point one thousand people. <laughs>
I was a flight attendant, was put on LOA. Well, we're doing this for you there in November and terminated January 24th for not taking the jobs. Well, ain't that funny because I believe January 24th was the day that I left for Ed Deer. Let's get you your job back. Yep. So the officers, we had this nice moving nice and slowly and nobody was being impeded on, but now the officers blocked the loop and uh, got us through a crawl. Ottawa Police Department, I'm sorry, but it's you that just stopped traffic. I should have ate some breakfast this morning. I'm hungry. But that's okay, because I'm going to eat all the freedom I want. You're fasting. Yeah, we're fat. I'm fatting while freedoming. Come on, Ottawa, get down to the airport. Any of you four wheelers? Even big rigs. Yeah, come on down, Patty. You live in Canada? Come on down. You're not that far. Watching from Redding, California. You are all heroes. I think you're going to save America. We're gonna save each country, one country at a time. No, we're not at Pearson, Angela. We're in Ottawa. <laughs> I'm not in Toronto, we're in Ottawa. Oh, we just got a plane landed. Cool. Oh, back of the spray painted truck. Freedom! Freedom! Let's go, baby! Let's go! Yeah. <laughs> We're having so much fun, guys. Any of you rig guys, any of you guys in the bobtails want to come out, come on down. You're more than welcome to. Just head towards the airport. See, look, traffic's moving now. Look at them all roll. Hey, guys. Freedom, baby! Oh, that's a hot five there. Let's go! Get your butts to Ottawa. We need numbers down here. We need to flood this city. So, yeah, we're asking everybody if you're in, uh, in the Ottawa area, we could definitely... Oh, this guy's coming in hot. Coming in hot, not for long. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you're in the Ottawa area, we need everybody to take to the streets today. Today is supposedly the threat that they're going to raid us today. And uh, there might be some people coming in on a flight that, uh, you know, want to make sure that we can't freedom anymore. So. You can't stop this, baby. We got Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, Jesus, got the wheel. Jesus, take the wheel, yeah. Can't stop, won't stop. That's been my saying for years. Yeah, the police stopped at eight. Did you see that? There was no police anymore. We're gonna go speed up a little bit and get up to the back of the convoy again. You like my police joke? What's the only, well, who's the only person that can piss off the Ottawa Police Department? 
Jerry can. <laughs> <laughs> Get those Jerry cans out there, guys. Yeah. Keep doing a good work. I seen so many yeah. down there yesterday. Yeah, and everybody who did that, and when I gave that shout out for everybody to grab a Jerry can, walk down the street with empties. Uh, good job. Thank you so much. Uh, and they were beating on them like drums and everything. Yeah, and they were <laughs> marching down the streets like V for Vendetta. It was pretty cool. Oh. No, he is one of us. I wonder if we all just parked our vehicles and then walked into the airport. <laughs> Here's your cops. These are all the police. Oh, I've got one more now, eh? Yeah, they got three. They got one no, Jeep. This one's not. No, she's not. These two, though. Look at the light on the mirror there. Definitely not bad. Where's the video tape? Yeah, this guy's. That guy. This Read guy's. Up, baby. Nice. Morning. Good morning, guys. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> You're just absolutely disgusting. Hey, buddy! Read him! Good morning. Read him! We got a wave. Good morning. Say good morning to the cops. <laughs> They're done. Yeah, good. You tell them you love them. Yeah, exactly. I just saw that. Six feet apart. You gotta be six feet apart in the line up there. Let's wave to all these people over here. Wait, ready? Look at them. They want it then. They're all lined up inside the airport. They're loving it. Remember guys, we're doing this for each and every one of them people in there. We're doing this for all of them. These poor people got to work with these masks on and they can't even catch COVID anymore. If you've caught COVID already, you have already got an immune system like a friggin' semi truck. You are running down the highway like a loaded freight train. Let's go. When you get this, your immune system builds up to it. People who had SARS, the original SARS, 17 years ago, still have antibodies in their bodies that they can't even catch the SARS-CoV-2. And it's been tested in the Singapore study. So go check out the Singapore study where they even injected people with the SARS-CoV-2 virus and they couldn't even catch it. So now you've got people who have already caught SARS who got to put, or COVID, that got to put this shit in their bodies for no reason, none whatsoever. Then you get in an airport, you gotta be six feet apart, you gotta go through all of that. Then you get on a plane and you're shoulder to shoulder with people. There's something wrong here. And if you're that stupid that you can't see it, then keep that mask on. Because I've sat on a plane with people who said they're jabbed even, and even being jabbed, well, <laughs> even being jabbed, they don't think it's right that they have to keep a mask on. And yeah, I called people stupid because you're not smart enough to use your cognitive brain to figure out that this is all nuts the whole thing is nuts but if you want to keep wearing your mask keep wearing your mask nobody has told you to take your mask off nobody i haven't personally i said you know what you might breathe a little better if you take it off because that's a breathing barrier not a mask when you put that mask on your face, you eliminate or you reduce your intake, oxygen intake by 13%. Your exhalation of CO2 has increased 8,000 times. We put the, the gas monitors to our faces and showed it and proved it. Ladies and gentlemen, you're, you're reducing your body from oxygen in the brain. Long-term effects of that's gonna be crazy. That's right. Crazy. Which reduces your thought process. When your brain's not getting enough oxygen, you can actually start killing off brain cells. Some people who have COPD or asthma or anything else that gives them a, a respiratory issue, bronchitis, stuff like that, you're already, already having a hard time bringing in oxygen into your lungs. Your lungs need the oxygen. It transforms it into your blood or, or, or um, absorbs it and then it goes into your blood 
and then your blood is oxygenated. If you're reducing that, your blood's not getting enough oxygen. You are actually 30% immunodeficient as soon as you put that first jab in your body. Then it just gets worse from there. What they are doing is making a civilization of people that are dependent on drugs. Your government is turning you into a an addict. You're going to be an addict because you're going to need drugs all the time to keep your body healthy. When you have a natural immune system that can do that for you. And for a lot of people who haven't seen my work and seen what we've done, we've actually proved in a court of law that the... Um, that the chief medical officer of health does not have the material evidence that I've requested and that was the isolation of the SARS-CoV-2 virus. The SARS-CoV-2 virus isolation. You must have that science to back up your mandates. Mandate. <laughs> Mandate. <laughs> <laughs> Let this lady, you can go in front of us. Yeah, she's trying to get out of here. She's going, what's going on Some here? Some of these people aren't too happy, but you know That's what? Okay. It's, it's five minutes out of your day that you were slowed down. You know what? That could have been five minutes. If you would have been a little bit sooner, maybe you would be in an accident up the road. You ever think like that? You know what? If I would have just stopped and never went, I wouldn't. Have, maybe that accident wouldn't have, hap wouldn't have happened. There's so many factors to this. You know that, guys? There's so many factors. We got ourselves a convoy! Blew the gate doing 98 with a reefer full of hogs. <laughs> we got a guy named Happy Troll saying we do, we're do we doing nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we're doing more than you. I'll tell you that much, okay? Yeah. We're doing more than you. So, you guys, pray for that troll there. Let's wake him up. Let's get him. Let us get. Let's get his spirit. Police are leaving. <laughs> so the police just left. They just went driving down the road and they're like, they're out of here. And we're not doing it. Quickly, anything. too. Because we're, we're not, not very safe. Because we're not doing anything wrong. We're not impeding on traffic. We're not doing anything. We're just going in a little parade. We're having a parade. You see, they should have never kicked me off that airplane. <laughs> I remember that. That's what you get. That's what you get. That's what you get. Top bow knock. This is a lot of fun. Everybody's having fun today. It's a good day. It's a good day. Also. There's an ambulance down on arrival center, guys. So uh, give them room. Let them get through. 10 to 4. Yeah. Do not impede emergency traffic, guys. You got the lights on. No, they're just sitting there, buddy. They're going to test you, too. They're going to make sure they're going to want to find somebody who's going to impede on emergency vehicles. Do not, I repeat, do not impede on emergency vehicles. They do that as a test. Yeah, you bet you that's exactly what they're doing. Can you keep out of the park, Dave? You've got to find them once you hit the mark for them. They're in arrival. Freedom! Let's go! Everybody move over, let him go. In your convoys! And how much you want to make a bet says somebody today is going to find something I said in my uh, clip and they're going to clip a little piece of it and make us look like a bunch of radicals. No, they got to go back like two, three years to find that shit. <laughs> Out from years ago. Two second clip. A little two second sound bite. <laughs> and causing it to make it look like I said it, like just now. Somebody put something in last night, I saw it. They said, oh, Pat, you're, you're Pat's losing and having a temper tantrum in Ottawa. No, that wasn't even in Ottawa in that video. <laughs> I, was in Ontario, I was in Alberta and I'm wearing clothes, I'm wearing shorts. It was in the summertime. Like, come on, you guys are reaching, like reaching so hard. 
to try and smear me. Do you think I give a shit if you smear me? I don't care. I know who I am. My friends know who I am. And all these people here know who I am. So, good luck. <laughs> Smear away. Pray for those people. Yeah, you need Jesus. You need to be touched by the hand of God. <laughs> there, I just touched him. Find your spirit, guys. And now, if you see, there's people lining up at the airport. Why? Because there's a flight coming in in 10 minutes. There's a flight coming in in 10 minutes. And nobody's harming anybody. Nobody's hurting anybody. Nobody's doing anything wrong. It's just a good day to have a parade. And now, that's what we're doing. We're parading. You're more than welcome to come join the parade. Bring a bouncy castle. <laughs> the Transpro. Yeah, bring a bouncy castle. Yeah, we got bouncy castles up on Wellington. Bring your kids down. Come have fun. Saturday. Saturday will be and a great Sunday. day. The guys got them up there, yeah. Go on down for the weekend for sure, you guys. They got lots of stuff for the kids going on. The organizers. Are yeah, I, that. I saw that actually in Quebec. Uh, uh, what did they call What was Hitler called? Hitler was called uh, the Fuhrer. The Fuhrer. Yeah, yeah, the Fuhrer. Yeah, the Fuhrer. Legault wants to keep Vax passes forever. This is bullshit. And Quebec, we are here to support you. We are here to, to help you guys out. We are here to make sure that you guys are going to get yours lifted. And for Francois Legault, the Fuhrer of Quebec, you, you, you really Fire. should run away. <laughs> you should get the hell out of Quebec. Hey, buddy. Freedom! Thanks, man. All We're you trying. premiers. Every one of you premiers. It's time to resign. It's time for you to step down. Francois Legault, this is a message from Alberta. We love Quebec, and the Albertans are here. And I got a ticket to the train station, if you want it. <laughs> Let's go, Trudeau. Let's go, Trudeau. Goodbye, Lego. <coughs> Jason Kenny, when you watch this, right? get out of there. You're done. Jason <laughs> Kenny, yeah, it's time for you to resign, too. Oh. Scott Moe, it's time for you to resign, too. Everyone here. All of you guys, bye-bye. Bye-bye. i see ya. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> Adios, amigos. Arrivederci. Hasta luego. And all that shit on your way out. And all those mandates. Yeah. All those premiers, you got to go have your own mandates together. Have your own little, have your own little group. They don't like us and they made us leave. Oh. It's what we want, though. You guys are all... Crimes against humanity. You guys are all horrible people. I can't believe that people just let this go for all these years. And I'm screaming, George is screaming, we're all screaming this for the last couple years. And and now, now, people are seeing how powerful you are in a group. You're seeing how, how big uh, of a stink you can make it. But now these guys are just flip-flop, flip-flop, flip-flop. They don't know which way to go. Ottawa police don't know which way to go. RCMP don't know which way to go. These are showing you the truth in Canada. These groups of people that are standing for their rights and liberties are showing you, are showing you that. He's loving it. He's loving it too, yeah. That, that big truck there, he just gave us a big thumbs up. That big truck, he's doing deliveries from the airport. Coming to the airport. Oh, he's leaving the airport. Oh, he's honking too. We got this, guys. Me, me. To Ottawa. Me, me. Me, me. All the boys at Coots, boys and girls, hold the line down there. Yeah, to the guys at Coots, Walker Trucking, all of the guys, good job, guys. To all the people that went down on horseback, good job. Everyone involved, hold that line there. Oh, now we got police right on the right here in the truck. Oh. 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 
it's all good in the hood. We got a police truck now. Commercial vehicle enforcement. Oh, He's yeah. got a baby Yoda in the front seat. Freedom! <laughs> He's videotaping everybody there, so he got me screaming freedom, right? In the camera. <laughs> Go ahead. Somebody said want Trudeau to come out and talk to us. Maybe we should throw out some chicken feed. <laughs> <laughs> we need some chicken feed. Bring us some scratch down. We need some scratch down here. Yeah. We'll put it in a big pile. <laughs> you can come down here. Come for a peck, eh? Yeah, you come for a little peck. Somebody bring us some chicken feed down here. We'll go lay it out oh. at number one Sussex Drive and see, <laughs> see if he'll come out and eat. <laughs> Him and his little pecker. <laughs> <laughs> Justin Trudeau's little pecker needs some chicken feed. Well, it's working though, eh, guys? Like it's uh, they're fighting within the within the government now. It's it's working so. All right. Hey, baby. That's a cool little car, man. That guy's Hi, ma'am. Oh, I love oh, you. We love you. We love you. God bless. God bless you, dear. God bless. Oh, it's your city? It's your city? Aw. Right on. God bless you. We love you. Enjoy your flight. We love you. I hope it lands safely. <laughs> get, the, get out of her city. Yeah. Get out of her city. Looks like you're already leaving. <laughs> Why would you leave it? Put that mask on. Get to. We love you! <laughs> she just gave me lots of love. <laughs> Man, as soon as we said it, as soon as we told her that we loved her, she just boiled right over. <laughs> That's the demons, man. They're coming out. Jesus is here, baby. Let's go! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go get some chicken feed here pretty soon. <laughs> We're gonna go buy a bunch of chicken feed. We're gonna go buy some chicken feed when we're done. We're gonna go lay it down right in the front of his house. Make it a trail. We should do it. We'll make a trail down to Parliament. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, perfect. We don't have any commercial. Perfect. We don't have any commercial vehicles in here. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I thought. I'd let you know, Pat. <laughs> Look at the baby Yoda in the front seat of his car. He's got a baby Yoda on the front seat. <laughs> freedom, freedom, freedom! <laughs> freedom in the voice. <laughs> This is what happens when God wakes you up and you're full of freedom. Let's go butt in up the line a bit, because we got the freedom truck. Let's say hi to everyone. Freedom! Freedom, baby! Let's go! <laughs> He's having fun, that guy. Freedom! <laughs> Freedom! Oh my God. Let's go! <laughs> oh, morale boosters, guys. Morale boosters. Freedom! Rights and liberties. What? Oh, I'm hearing that siren. Oh so my, I heard it too. Oh, here comes a FedEx plane. I wonder if they're going to get their deliveries on time. Oh, 
And there's the there's the Porter airplane just coming in, taxiing off the runway. They mentioned you guys on Global News, did they? Uh, right on. About being at the airport? Did they say there might be delays in flights? <laughs> Tell them there's no delays on Freedom Airline. No delays at all. Freedom is on schedule. Freedom is on schedule, yeah. Hi, guys. Freedom Airlines, baby. <laughs> Freedom Airlines. That flight will never be late. Mass green flights. Are you legally allowed to be this happy in Canada? <laughs> <laughs> they might tax it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they might tax us <laughs> from being happy. A happy tax. <laughs> That's awesome. Remember, guys, you're not allowed to fly if you're not jabbed, so should have never kicked me off the plane. See, this is unacceptable. Yeah, a fringe minority with unacceptable views. Yeah, they don't stand for the views of all of other Canadians. Yeah, well, I, I beg the death for you. I think the votes are in. Oh, look at this lady blocking traffic for us. Loving it. Right We're on. starting to get spectators down here now. Yeah, we got Ottawa spectators now. It, uh, you put it out on Global, there's going to be a flood of people come down here. I love the baby Yoda on the front of his truck. Americans are getting hyped. Let's go. Convoy to D.C. Shut her down. Let's go. Let's go. Time to take our whole world back, you guys. That up top. They're gonna come in with their emergency vehicles and do their photo shoots. That's what they'll do. Guaranteed. And they'll be like, oh, they're impeding traffic. Look what's happening. They'll take their shots and then they'll put it out there like this has all been adorable. So just be prepared for the smears. If you're live right here, right now. You people do realize that critical medical supplies get sent by air. You could be costing people their lives. Oh. Um, excuse me. <laughs> I want to tell you something right now. Um, I understand your concern for medical supplies. Uh, maybe there's a flight of uh, experimental gene therapies coming in. No, we don't want uh, that. And maybe there's traffic open for everybody um, to get in and out. Um, you're not here. You're not seeing what we're doing. The lanes are wide open. People can come and go as they please. And some people might be three minutes late. Some people might be five minutes late. But you know what? Freedom is never late. <laughs> Freedom will never be late. Freedom is always on time. And that's what matters. So you can say that we're impeding on medical supplies. You can say that we're hindering people's mobility, but we're not. And here's a perfect example. There you the go. lane is wide open. This one lane is wide open and nobody is causing a stir or anything. There's a whole lane open. If any medical vehicles come then we pull yeah. over and let them by simple as that see that whole lane wide open maybe that's in one of our convoy vehicles What's that siren coming down in the uh, arrivals there, guys? Are we okay? Any emergency vehicles in the arrivals? Love you, man. Freedom! You live here? Yeah. Yeah? Can't stop me. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. yeah, I didn't go to work. You didn't go to work today? Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't care. Say that on camera. I don't care, man. It's freedom. Yeah. Okay. Good. Freedom's always free, buddy. Always. Always. I can't fly anywhere. No, no, none of us can. I can't see my daughter how many years, you know? Because I can't fly. Yeah. You know? we're here for, bud. Thanks for joining. There's a local. There's your, there's your proof, guys. So. Yeah. You're a good man. Yeah, oh, right on. Done. You're an awesome Gas. dude. Gas. Yeah. Right on. We had a local guy come down with a whole bunch of gas for our little convoy. <laughs> Guys, the mandates, period. Not just for flying. All mandates, period. End them. It's over. Stop the bullshit. Uh, we are having a big party. We're doing a Freedom Festival in August in Alberta. Uh, we're putting it together right now with hundreds of friggin' wicked bands, DJs, everything. There will be a Freedom Festival this summer in Alberta. We're putting it together. So, convoys aren't stopping. We're also got another convoy of Harleys. We're going to be rolling the bikes across Canada once the snow is over. And we'll be doing a giant Harley thunder roll all the way across Canada. And to meet up in no other place but Ottawa. Oh, we've been at Freedom. this now for two hours. Freedom. We've been at this for two hours. Let's go. Oh yeah. I love the I can't wait to get back on the bike. Oh I can't wait. Riding in a Harley in a big pack, nothing like it. Nothing like it. You think convoy is fun? Get in the pack with the boys and the girls and you're riding three feet apart. That's how you build a trust. That's how you build brotherhood. You're riding three feet apart from each other. All the way across Canada. There's the media. There's the media. The media's here. We got the media here, guys. The media's here. Yeah, I was just saying, I wondered where they were going to pop out at. There yeah, the media just showed up. Good. Hello, media. Let's go. Let's report some more bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> On today's bullshit news, crazy, radical convoyers shut down Ottawa Airport for hours. Terrorizing. A couple more, yeah. We got more gas. We got gas right behind us. Yeah, lots of gas. <laughs> that fella right behind us. The guy right behind us has gas. The guy in the Toyota. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. She the said revolution it. will be televised. That's right. <laughs> We're really doing it. We're really. Do We're really doing it. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, there's another cop cart. Somebody said, how dare you stand up for our rights? <laughs> <laughs> how dare you? <laughs> Imagine if Greta Thunberg was in this convoy right now, she'd be just losing her marbles. Oh, the CO2 that you're putting in the atmosphere. Oh, you mean the same CO2 that makes oxygen through photosynthesis? Oh, you mean that vital 
vital, Freedom. vital gas that has to be part of the environment so that trees can produce oxygen. <laughs> yeah, without CO2, you do not get oxygen. Why do they want to reduce the carbon in the atmosphere? Hmm. Start thinking about that one, folks. And you might have research. you might have yourself a conspiracy theory. Yeah. Oh, you lost the horn. I got a burnt down horn. Nobody, I repeat, nobody talks to media. Nobody talks to the media. That's the 10 4. If you see somebody sitting down, gonna do an interview, get them out of the interview. Roger that. 10 4. We are the news. Freedomforusall.ca. Go and support us there. Help us freedom fight. There's new gear up there for you guys to buy. Helps us stay here. No, we were moving fairly good until the cops actually stopped us and started to bottleneck. And once you start that, you just keep going. That's okay. That's all right. It was their fault, not ours. That's right. That's what they say. They started it. I think we got one of the Ottawa Police Department guys are in the convoy with us. I think he wants to play convoy too. <laughs> he's in the line there. He's, he's leaving now. He's getting out. You betcha. Doesn't the 10 million help you stay there? I think we're just doing such a good job that we're joining him. <laughs> Yeah, that's not us, man. We don't have access to any of that money. You know what it's like in the uh, in the rest of the world, right? Everybody's saying that if you're against the convoy, then you're getting like harassed online if you don't like the convoy. I think we've changed the numbers. We flipped the tide. Raise those vibes, guys. Raise those vibes. Love you, Pat. Freedom. 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 Look at this, what's this girl doing? Oh, got your camera. What's that? I'm looking to speak to somebody who's organizing this part of the convoy. Oh, everybody's doing it. I get everybody's doing it. There's nobody organized anything. Okay, so yeah. we, well, we understand that there's been a group that's come here from the ballpark. And we're just trying to establish who organized that group. They well, all decided to get out there and did, do what they wanted yeah, to do. Four media walking down the back side of the back yeah. down there. Uh, two cameras going now, guys. So we decided to, to go home. I think when we're all hungry, I think they got lunch at like yeah. 10 30 or something. Everything's good. Okay. Yeah, okay. That's it. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. you guys have a great day. You Thank too. you. Trying to get somebody to admit to be an organizer, right? So now they're trying to get somebody to, to who organized this. And we good, said all of us did. Good thing everybody did. Let's go. They're trying to, when she said, we're trying to understand how long this is going to go on for. <laughs> until we decide to go home. It's going, it's, it's going until the mandates are gone. And the premiers are gone. Yep. The Prime Minister is gone. And the dissolving of the Liberal Party. Oh, this guy going to try and get us? Yeah. No, see, and we let people in and drive and do their thing. Yeah. He's getting in. He's taking off. He, you know, he's going to he, he's gonna have an extra three minutes wait to get out of the airport here. So we're just doing a photo shoot. <laughs> yeah, we're just doing a photo shoot. Now we got the media here. They're coming up right now. Oh, yeah, here they are. They're getting set up. No flipping the fingers to the media. Everybody turn their backs to the media. Do not look at them. Or scream freedom at them. Just do it. 
That's right, Pat. We told them that they were just fake news. That's all. Yeah. yeah. Fake news. Fake news. Just smile and wave, boys. Just smile and wave. That's right. Freedom. Yeah, freedom. Back. That freedom ring. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> we can do and it. And everybody, everybody organized this. There's not one organizer. Everybody organized this. Roger that. Just had the police pull over and wanted to find out who it was. So that's what we're sticking with. Everyone. Oh. It's organized. It's just coincidence. Huh? Yeah, we all wanted to go see if we could take a flight home. We wanted to go home. Get these fake newsers over yeah, here. We all denied a flight, so we're just going to try to get out of the airport. Freedom! Freedom! Fake news. Fake news! Let me guess, you're going to say that we impeded traffic and we created Freedom! a habit. But we didn't. It all went. <laughs> Freedom! Get out your fake news, you're gonna need to. As soon as he seen it was me, he put the camera up, I just ducked back like this. <laughs> get out of here, bro. Get well, out of here. They'll videotape us when we come around. Well, I'll get the Freedom Truck, right? Because the Freedom Truck is a good poster for this. So <laughs> it's awesome. I wish we would have had time to wash it first, but whatever, it just gets dirty <laughs> again. We haven't, I haven't washed my truck since we left Alberta for crying out loud. Dirty hands means clean money. <laughs> there, it's that guy. We, I knew he was in our convoy. Freedom, freedom, freedom! In the pest control extermination. <laughs> He's got a pest control truck. <laughs> George, that truck will be worth a million dollars after all this. <laughs> it's worth more than that to me right now. It's priceless right now. Pat, viewer said if they ask who organized it, tell them Trudeau organized it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Trudeau organized it. <laughs> That's our answer from now on. When somebody asks us who organized it, we're going to say Trudeau did it. <laughs> <laughs> Big chicken. Don't talk to hey guys, if everybody gets asked who organized this, tell them Justin Trudeau organized this. <laughs> it really, he did. He did. Thank you, Justin, yeah. for uniting yeah. our country. Thank you, Justin. Thank you, Justin Trudeau. Hashtag. The only good thing you did since you got in office. <laughs> yeah. Hashtag thank you, Justin. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody needs to get on the get Justin Trudeau's phone number and you phone him and you thank him for what he's done. Flood his phone. Flood him with emails, flood his office with thank phones saying thank you for off the Quebecers and the Alberta. Actually every province at once. Thank you for pissing everybody off. We have better freedom back. Yes, blame everybody else because you guys are grifters. Oh, yeah. Oh, Kathy Olson. I love you. Yeah, I love you. Pray for her. Pray for Kathy, guys. And bye-bye. <laughs> and bye-bye. And bye-bye, Kathy. That's a good <laughs> That's our Saskatchewan, bro. We got, he's even got his Batman playing up. This is the first job. Bed, bath, and beyond. And then I got this job. I want to get some bath bombs, baby. <laughs> They're trying to trash it and turn the words on CTV. Well, now you know who the paid media is. Yeah, more proof. 
take those clips off there and get some clips off of this live or whatever and uh, get it out there and show what's really going on you guys we need the internet warriors to help us out you know did get that get whatever the mainstream media is saying and put it beside what's going on here and just debunk them just keep showing them see the van ctv van edmonton had to scrape the fucking decals off the van <laughs> <laughs> scared the driver oh yeah here did you guys hear this CTV in Edmonton had to take the decals off their van because they were getting so much hate. <laughs> CTV was driving around in their van and they were they, they have to take it off. Say hello to our police officers. <laughs> Fast tracking reopening. Yeah, well, you're not fast enough. <laughs> you better get on it. Buddy. Better get on it. You're a little late. Yeah. About, about three weeks late almost. Yeah. Finish your fucking donuts. Let's no, go. Let's, let's go. go Doug. <laughs> Put the fucking donuts down. Get to work. Wow, you politicians, man. You guys can backpedal all you want, but you resign. Yeah. You resign. Get so inside. Inside of uh, those parties and stuff, get after your get after your premiers, get after them. We want them gone. Yep. Put someone else in charge for now, and uh, we we build from there. So we're giving you advice as a friend because we do love you. Okay, resign, get the fuck out, change those mandates to be nice, and maybe you can show your face around the world someday. Okay? Not likely, but. <clears throat> Do we run out and get in front of that camera and scream freedom? Yeah. Freedom! <laughs> make it loud, make it loud by these reporters. <laughs> Fake news. Freedom! 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 Hey, news reporter, where's your mask? <laughs> Make it loud by those reporters, guys. Keep on those horns. Make her loud. We are winning, winning, winning. Yeah, we got a lot of numbers in that dub stall, man. What's that? Dubs all day. Dubs? Dubs. That's a oh, dubs? Stall wins. dubs? Who's got the General Lee horn? That's a fucking red car. That's awesome. Yeah. That's awesome. All right, guys. So I want to tell you this. It's your municipalities who have the option of putting the mandates in place. Now, got to remember this. Edmonton is what's called a sanctuary city. They took tons of money. The mayor of Edmonton took a shit ton of money. The mayor of Calgary took a shit ton of money. Guys, chase the dollars. You're going to find it. These people are playing in a league of their own. Now, you start chasing the dollars, go look at their private. Ask for a financial audit of all municipality members. Anybody who's pushing this vax, anybody who's pushing these mandates, they've taken a ton of money. They cannot back away from it. But when they back away from it, then they can be criminally charged. Because I'll tell you right now, you, you look at their finances, you're gonna see a very, very big increase. Ottawa mayor is worth $20 million. Why is the Ottawa mayor worth $20 million? He's just a mayor. Now we got 12,000 people in here. We haven't even dropped. <laughs> just, just holding it. Good. At the TV. 
At the TV, they said 30 trucks. Can tell me the real number, please? We don't know. Well, I don't 30. know. I don't know how many. There's more, way well, more than 100 30. 100 maybe? 100 there's trucks? There's 100 maybe? for sure, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we got about 100 for sure. And there's people coming in as they're watching the live. They're getting in here further and further. People coming from all over the city, far and wide. Let's go! <laughs> Get Karen booty. Body? What does that say? Get Karen bot bot. I have TikTok. I just don't do a lot of TikTok because I used to have like 60, 70,000 followers on TikTok and then they banned me. I said, well, that's too bad. I'm not going to do this anymore. That's stupid. I've got a lot of people at hard at work to keep my Facebook open. I also have Instagram as well. So as soon as they take down the Facebook, we'll go to Instagram. Good angels watching over us. We're good. We've got lots of people in the background that are working very tirelessly. And to all the people that are helping me keep my, my feeds up, thank you. Oh, here we go. What's this guy got here? Cameraman. We ain't stopping, baby. Get out. You're fired. <clears throat> Simple. Drop the mandates. Retire. Do whatever you got to do. Go. All that money that you took to push all these narratives, all this bullshit, go retire. Go hide somewhere with that money that you took. God will take care of you after that. <clears throat> Never want to change your name. <laughs> no. Take take all that dirty money that you that you took. We'll go live with it somewhere. Because we don't want you here anymore. It's uh real underscore pat underscore king on Instagram. Oh, we're going to go departures this round. I don't care. Where's every way you want to go? Oh, we went that way. This is like NASCAR. Round and around and around and around and around and around and around. So did you know the, uh, did you guys know this? Did you know the chief of police was hired by Blackwater? And uh, they're part of, their CEO of it is Fi the C uh, former CEO of Pfizer. Did you know that? You do now. Start digging, guys. The more you know, the more you know. Convoy, Justin Trudeau put together, Justin. Thank you, Justin. Thanks, Justin. Oh, and the sun's coming out now. It's a good day. Left my sunglasses too.
So those people out there that are your uh, our East Coast Maritimers, uh, get in your boats, all your lobster boats, all your uh, all your fishing boats. You guys are linking up around the harbors. Um, I know the guys in the United States are starting to gear up too. The guys in the United States are all gearing up to uh, be uh, starting their convoys real soon. I believe it's leaving from New York all the way down to California. Um, the convoys are going to start rolling in the states. Australia's rolling their convoys. Um, All over. There's like 30 countries. The whole countries. world. The whole world is going, guys. That's amazing. The United States is getting pumped. Yeah, the getting states pumped. are getting pumped up now. Look, there's a guy parked down there with a Freedom Canada flag on the back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Probably parked there doing that uh, video. Start the convoy on the 14th. What's that? Israel starting a convoy. Israel. Israel starting a convoy on the 14th. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Let's go, you guys. Everybody's watching Canada. Get it out there. I love playing convoy. I heard New York started. Not sure if it's true. Yeah, we saw something about it. Ward 5, Sarah Hamilton in Edmonton is... Is the one behind that sanctuary city truckers go park by her house? I check my battery. Actually, you got uh, cable cord for me? Where's your cord? I forgot it. Yeah, it's a good thing I babysit you guys. I know, buddy. That's why we love you. Dude. That's why we're rolling, baby. Oh, that's my cord. No, that's my cord. <laughs> you have one like mine? it. You left behind. <laughs> that's mine. Mine, 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 Hang on, guys. Going to plug us in. <laughs> that guy's horn in the back is hilarious. Me, 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 me. That's Nick, I baby. Drive, I just beep randomly. <laughs> <laughs> you do it. You get her going. Blow those horns. Get your flags up. Get all your flags up. This is home, baby. So that was probably that that officer. That officer was probably the one who called me and said, uh, "Pat, can we meet somewhere?" Because it was a female officer, eh? Yeah, it was. It. Yeah. Are the fishermen in Halifax on board? Absolutely, they are. Get on there. Let's go. Paris, France is threatening jail time if they start a convoy. Ah, for Get everyone? in them trucks. Get in them trucks. There's but, not enough jail cells in the world to hold all of us. Just like Quebec, and they're threatening too. Get it? Quebec, France? Yeah. Brutal. brutal. Leaving from California. Hang on. Leaving from California to D.C. Can't wait. I'm leaving out of Texas. Right on. Right on. March 1st to the 7th. March 1st, 7th, U.S. starting. I'm in Minnesota, and we're planning... Each state has their own group, one main group, then each region has a group. Route planned out to D.C. from California. Okay, right on, guys. I'm in Kentucky. I'm in Kentucky. But it sure seems like I'm in Canada in a Freedom Convoy. Right on. Right on, guys. Good thing I have all my work done in the office today. I can't stop watching. <laughs> <laughs> right on. My friends in Florida can't believe what we're going through. Pat, please, private. Cat Miller, I can't private message anybody. My private messages are so swamped, I can't even check them. I don't know what to say. Yeah. Get it on time, anyways. Maybe one day you can catch up on a million messages. We're not ignoring you, we're busy. Simple as that. Look at that getting those guys in the truck, they're real good. Oh yeah. Good. <laughs> this is a good one. Question for the haters. Are you scared of freedom or just scared of being wrong? <laughs> <laughs> scared of being wrong. That's exactly it. Oh look at they're gearing up here now. <laughs> hey, you're gonna get hit if you stand on the road, eh? Freedom! Oh, anybody to get hurt. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Put it up to, let's show these guys here. Are 
There you go. Freedom! Let's see how pumped these guys are when we get up there. I don't know. You're. The police said, "Get down." We say no. Look, fuck off. I'd get. I. You do what you got to do, do guys. Do what you want, man. Do what you want. Freedom, baby. That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting in my work truck, drinking Timmy's, watching you dudes. Freedom. Fuck. I wish I could be with you guys. You are with us, Jordan. You are, buddy. When we do freedom stuff and we're freedoming, I'll be live every time. Uh, what are we at? 10 o'clock? We started at 7.30. 7.30 from back there. We're doing good. Yeah, we can duck out any time and go do our own stuff. These yeah. guys can keep rocking. It's not a big deal. We can just kind of... So, so yeah. Uh, I don't know. I'm kind of having fun. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to leave. <laughs> no. This is fun. Yeah. <laughs> That guy's got three masks on. What the fuck, man? So, we got a guy driving in his car by himself with three masks. So now he's got minus Watch 50%. This guy. Watch this guy. Minus 50%. Sorry, no. Jesus. Jesus, man. Save that guy. Pray for that guy there. Lord help him, man. Lord, Lord help that dude. Man, they're just scared. They're just scared because of the propaganda. And over here, they're scared way more than Alberta or Saskatchewan or BC. Like, they're scared over here. These people have been brainwashed because they have the numbers here. They have the population. We don't need to go get it. Hundreds of thousands of people hugging, <laughs> drinking from the same cups, no masks, and nobody's dropping fucking dead. Nobody even went to the hospital, not one. <laughs> not one. Not one. On, yeah. on Saturday, it'll be two weeks here. All right, so there you go. Yeah. Fucking get it. Wake up, please. Please. We need you. Stick this fucking bullshit right up to your nose. Good luck. Yeah. Somebody said, you think they're scared here? You should go to friggin' New Brunswick. Really? Yeah, it's really bad there. See, we're letting this lady in right here so she can get out. And she just waved. She's, she's awesome. You know? We're not blocking anybody. We're slowing people down and making them wake up. That's what we're doing. Wakey, wakey! Hey guys, I think after this we should go get some chicken feed and go to Sussex Drive and lay down some chicken feed outside the gate. See if he comes outside. <laughs> U.S. convoy going from Calgary to D.C. March 4th. You should, get, you should get some live chickens and drop them in Justin's yard. <laughs> Dress them up in a little suit like Justin and get an interview with the media. Okay, okay, so we're not... How much longer are we going to do this? I don't know, how much longer you guys want to go for? I say we all start rolling back to Coventry for lunch and let's plan something else for this afternoon. Yeah, it sounds like a good plan. Okay, start passing the word around. Everybody roll back to Coventry and we're gonna go for lunch. Hey, Three hours at this was pretty good. I love it. Well, just, yeah. A bunch yeah. of locals showed up. They'll probably be doing this for the next hour. Or two, yeah. yeah. Let them keep going. We can we can take off and they can go as long as they want. So we started it. Block the TV station this afternoon. Ooh. We should maybe start rolling to the news outlets. I like that. Yeah. Thank you, Ryan. Good idea. Oh. Yeah, that wouldn't be a bad idea either. Let's all meet up at Coventry and let's make a plan. Roger that. Anybody back there that's on this channel, uh, let the guys know behind you that we're at the Coventry. Everybody's going to roll back to Coventry and then run into the. You guys are a little late to the party. 
That guy's perfectly safe walking with fresh air and his mask on. Okay, so we're not condoning or condemning <laughs> people for wearing masks. What it is is if you're wearing, tri watch this guy. Yeah. If you're wearing triple, quadruple masks, that's not, that's Scott, like you are impeding on your so intake. Yeah, gonna yeah, let's us. get, hey, let's get everybody rolling down here. Oh, whatever, let them keep rolling. We're getting away so the cops can't catch us first. So we'll get back to Coventry and see you guys there. And we're gone. There we go, guys. <clears throat> the convoy is still going back there, but we're going to head out and sneak away. Because we got freedom shit to do. We got to go do some more freedoming. As you can see, the city's not all jammed up like they say. And, uh, yeah, media saying Ottawa is completely all. They took over Ottawa. No. We took over downtown Ottawa, most of it. Slow roll around the schools for every job. Portugal watching. Yeah, yeah. That's I don't want to go to the schools and let the kids see the convoy. Oh, there's a good one. We can go roll the schools, yeah. Every yeah, child yeah, yeah. matters, baby. Let's Every go. child matters, That'd absolutely. That's a good part of a plan for sure, right? So uh, we're going to go eat lunch, guys. I'm going to sign out. We'll be back in a little bit. Thanks for joining us. Just watch all day today. We're going to be doing convoys all over Ottawa. So we're going to do some slow rolling and uh, happy freedom. -y. Freedom! Let's go! Let's go. <laughs>